Well, folks, it finally happened. A new hand touches the beacon. I don't know why it's so widely regarded as just being horrible, but everybody seems to loathe this quest, and that has my interest peaked. Now before we get into it, I do have an exciting announcement. I have been nominated to participate in the GERFTuber of the Month competition. Quick shout out to 16 Bits and Bobs for hosting, as well as Mark Goes Blind Gaming for nominating me. Now I don't know if you guys know this about me, but I am just a little competitive. And what I mean by that is I've already been talking some some talk so I need you guys to help me cash that check all you have to do my lovely loyal viewer is go leave a comment voting for me so be sure to check out the link in the description and go vote for your favorite creator which is me obviously don't even look at the other guys oh and good luck to my competitors I guess y'all are gonna need it all right, folks, the break of dawn. So the main objective is to bring Meridia's beacon to Mount Kilcreeth. Kil- Kilcreeth. Yeah. So let's go ahead and see how far I have to travel. Oh, that's not actually too bad. I have a fast travel point right there. Oh, this is gonna be great. What do you mean I cannot fast travel when enemies are nearby? I'm in a city. It's not gonna make me hoof it all the way, is it? Is, is that a dragon? Oh, that's why I couldn't fast travel. There's a dragon, everybody. Oh boy. Oh, oh, okay. Let's work together, team. We can do it. I got a hit. I helped. Good thing it's flying so slow. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh, here we go. This is actually going pretty well. Having some help from some Windhelm guards is helping. It's almost dead. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. As long as I get the soul, happy with that, baby. Where is it? Is it running? I feel like it's running. Where did it go? Hello? It was almost dead. No, not again. <laughs> Why do these dragons just keep leaving? Okay, well, that wasn't my fault. You know, the dragon just decided to leave. Again. Anyways, can I fast travel now? please now that i have fought a dragon all right so we're on the road it shouldn't be too far yeah this isn't gonna be bad at all i'm curious as to why so many people like hate this quest because all of the content i've seen regarding the beacon has just been negative not to be optimistic or jinx myself or anything but excited to see how fast this thing goes downhill restore to me my beacon that I might guide you toward your destiny. Uh, here you go. Why am I floating? Oh, we're going somewhere. It is time for my splendor to return to Skyrim. I have brought you here, mortal, to be my champion. You will enter my temple, retrieve my artifact, and destroy the Defiler. Okay. I, I'm having a hard time focusing on what you're talking about because I'm like a mile above the ground. I will send down a ray of light. Guide this light through my temple and its doors will open. Okay, so that was supposed to happen. Weird. That was weird. So I'm starting to gather why people might not like this. This sounds like it's going to be a marathon of a quest. <laughs> Oh, is this her light? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. It's gonna be a whole thing. What am I supposed to do? That? Yeah, okay, that. Well, that was ominous. Oh. Stay on your guard. That's right, Serana. Stay on your guard. We got ghost things. I don't even know what it is. Oh, it's corrupted shade. Well, they're no match for me, so not even worried about it. Oh, there's another one. Not even worried about it. How did that not kill him? Killed the other two. Oh, yes. Action shot. 
Okay, so activate again. Okay, a lot more straightforward than I thought it was gonna be. So far, so good. Oh, prepare to get owned. I said prepare to get owned. Oh, oh, that still hit. Hell yeah. Oh, I'm on a roll. They haven't even seen me yet, babe. What's going on He's with there. the battle music? Oh, that's what's going on with the battle music. Okay, vampire time, everybody. Yay, vampire powers. I'm just gonna melee this guy. Yeah, take that. I guess I really didn't need vampire powers, but come on. I haven't whipped him out yet. Well, alrighty. We are just cooking with gas, everybody. Let's activate the pedestal. Activate that door. And we're just on a roll, babe. Do a little bit of light grave robbing. Why would you have an urn if it's empty? That makes no sense to me. Put loot in there. Desecrated corpse. Why is he desecrated? What happened to him? Should I be scared? Hello. Oh, more? Dude, how much more? Is this why nobody likes this quest? Because it's just like a lot? A marathon of a quest. Unlock chest expert? Oh no. <laughs> I can do it. I can do it. Oh, ooh, ooh, okay. We have a small inclination as to where the sweet spot is. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. that's what I'm talking about. All right, more dungeon. Hell yeah. Oh, I see a little creepy guy creeping up on us behind this pillar. There he is. There's the cheeky guy himself. Dead before we even hit the ground, yeah? Activate pedestal. Yeah, all right. Still not tired of that yet, and I've done it like five times. And dead. That's never gonna get old. Love that. They don't even have any gold on them. What kind of ghost doesn't have gold on him? That desecrated corpse had gold on him, you know, and he's been desecrated. Can I jump this? I forgot A is not jump. Is it Y? Yeah, it's Y. Why? Why can't it be A? Why is it Y? Just a little taste of comedy for you. And parkour. Oh yeah, first try. Oh, can't walk in the light. Who would have thought? I don't know why everybody's complaining. You know, this quest has been fun so far. I'm getting lots of rewards. Lots of loot, you know? Can't complain about that, baby. Oh, look at that death shot right in the neck. Get on my level. There's another one sneaking in from the flank. Not today. Enjoy that death shot, you little punk. Okay, more beacons. Here we go. Did I do it? Okay, now we can go in the main door. Can I just like... Yeah, okay, good. I didn't take fall damage. Who has time to go all the way back around? Not me. Stay on your guard. What do you see, Serana? Do you see more ghost guys? Oh yeah, more ghost guys. Oh, that looks like a, a main guy right there, if I've ever seen one. Look at that kill shot. Oh, there's so many guys. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Nobody sees me, nobody sees me, see? They don't know. They actually don't. I can't believe they didn't come through the door. Oh, I'm playing a dangerous game here. Yeah, yeah. Vamp time. Have some sparkles. See what you think of that. Saran is really taking one for the team. Being some nice bait. Why aren't these guys dying? Die. Do you not feel the wrath of my sparkles? Oh, he's he's hurting me a lot. Uh, uh-oh. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we're just gonna take some potions. It's all good. Oh, and Serana's back up and at it. Oh, that's a tough looking shade. Can I have like a shade too? Oh, is he dead? He is dead. This is his second form. This guy isn't even tough, you know? I can just go in and just kill him, you know? What's he gonna do? Nothing. It is done. 
The Defiler is defeated. Hell yeah. Take Dawnbreaker from its pedestal. I don't know what that is, but sure, lady. We didn't even fight in, like, the actual chamber room. We fought in the hallway to the boss room. <laughs> Alright, what's Dawnbreaker? That, I guess? Take the mighty Dawnbreaker, and with it purge corruption from the dark corners of the world. Wield it in my name, that my influence may grow. A little narcissistic, but alright. Oh yeah, look, I'll keep the sword, but find someone else to spread your religion. Yeah. It matters not. The plant cares nothing for the rays that bring it the warmth of the sun. As you carry Dawnbreaker, so will my light touch the world. That wasn't even that bad. Alright, well, the final verdict on the Meridia Beacon quest is not that bad, you know? Not that bad. I don't see why it's so widely hated. Anyways, folks, let's move on. I have a fun little quest for us. Astrid, of the Dark Brotherhood, has given me my first major contract. I am to contact M Mur M Muri. I'm just gonna call her Muri. The apothecary's assistant in the Hag's Cure in Markarth. I feel like such an idiot trying to read anything in this game. <laughs> Yuri has apparently performed the Black Sacrament and is trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. So we're gonna go do that. We're gonna go do some Dark Brotherhood stuff. Some contracted killing. Some organized crime. Oh, we're going somewhere I haven't gone before. Oh, I'm gonna have to hoof it. All right, everybody. Get ready for a road trip. Aren't you even curious where we're going? No. Serana, what are you doing? Why is she fighting the horse? Hello? That's the horse. Why are you guys fighting? Friend, not foe. Friend, not foe. Get back here. Jeez. Am I going the right way? Kinda. There's a road. The road's going the right way, so I'm gonna say yeah. Yeah, I am going the right way. What a beautiful part of this game. Look at this aggressive minus all the things trying to kill me this is just lovely hello how art thou it should be good it should be good it's imperials should i kill him i'm gonna I, i'm gonna i'm gonna fight these guys Saran is immediately fighting so is my horse we're all fighting serana jeez girly pop you do some damage, don't you? Oh, the horse! <laughs> Why? Why? Why does the horse keep doing this? Serana, don't you kill the horse. Is it time to get a new horse? I'm starting to feel like it's time to just full send off a cliff and get a new horse. Sorry, Thunder. I gotta put you down. How's your leg, huh? How's your leg? You ready to race? Huh? This is Markarth, Traveler. Markarth. Safest city in the reach. Markarth. Markarth. Saying it so I don't forget it. First time in Markarth, Traveler? Yes. Take my advice. You see anything, don't get involved. The city guard will take care of it. Alright. No promises. Bit of jewelry for your journey home. Oh, this pendant would look to the lovely on my sister. <laughs> burn it, burn I cannot bust you. <laughs> Yeah! We are the rightful rulers of Martha! Yeah. Guess it's all clear now. By the Divines, the Forsworn are here in the city! Everyone stay back. The Markor City Guard have this all under control. There are no Forsworn here. I've been here for ten seconds and a lady just got stabbed. Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. Okay, sir. Thank you all of a sudden giving me a note. That was bananas, though. To be here for two seconds and to immediately just witness a murder like that. That's why I love Skyrim. Eltris wants to meet me at the Shrine of Talos. Alright, cool. Whole another quest all of a sudden. Oh, look. Here's the lady. Hey, lady. Let's talk about this organized crime in the open. Why are you looking at me like that? Because I'm here to talk to you. I didn't know it when we were with each other, but Elaine is actually the leader of a band of cutthroats. 
Bandits. They're holed up in some old dwarven ruin. Raldbathar. It's near Windhelm. They use it as their base. It's where they stage their raids. I want you to go to that ruin, find Elaine Dufont, and kill him. I don't care about his friends. Do whatever you want with them. But Elaine has to die. I'll just kill them all. Clean sweep, babe. There is one more thing. If you're interested. Lay it on me, girly pop. If you can, I want you to kill someone else as well. You don't have to, not as part of our deal, but if you do, I'll pay you even more. It's Nilsine Shattershield in Windhelm. If Nilsine dies too, I'll make it worth your while. Okay, hardcore. I planned to kill Elaine myself, you know. Nilsine too, but lost my nerve. I even brewed a special poison, Lotus Extract. Maybe you could use it? Sure, hand it over. Just coat your weapon with it. Then, you get the idea. Sweet, dude. Make them all pay all right, for what they've cool. done to me. So I like how they're in Windhelm, which is literally all the way across the map. But it's fine, because I'm going to fast travel. Um, So let's go to Windhelm proper first. And we'll do the optional part. And then we'll go kill the guy. A two for one. A bogo, if you will. Who's there? I'm getting out of here. Is the dragon back? Oh my hell, the dragon's back. Okay, well, we're in Windhelm this time, so maybe it'll actually stay. Ooh, yeah, it's just chilling. Oh, no, I gotta kill it. Let me kill it. My dragon, get out of here. Yeah, I did it all by myself. Give me the soul. Give me the soul. Yum, yum, dragon soul. Give me it. Yeah, power. Hell yeah. Suck that stuff up with the straw, babe. Okay, excuse me, everybody. I have a murder to commit. Just need y'all to get out of my way like a little bit. Thank you. Okay. This might actually be perfect. While everybody's distracted, I can go commit a murder. All right, well, it seems like she's right here. Yeah, okay. Well, bye. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, baby. Oh, look at how she died. That's kind of embarrassing. One down, one to go. That's what I'm talking about. Am I not efficient? Am I not good at organized crime? All right, let's solve this then. Why is it so high tech and industrial in here? I thought I was playing a medieval game. You're gonna die. I love that. I really do. All right, can't go that way. Closed off. Yeah. Oh, expert. I'm not afraid. I'll do it. <laughs> Just need to find the sweet spot, you know? Oh. 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 <laughs> Ding. Like that? Oh. <laughs> Get on my level, baby. Can we do like a nice little flank maneuver? Yeah. All right. All right. This is what I'm talking about. Let's see. Um, How do I poison my arrows can i do that oh, i can poison my bow hell yeah really make this guy pay who's there <laughs> they don't even know oh everybody's dying around you what are you gonna do oh i was gonna say die also but then i missed oh boy okay okay sir that's aggressive Sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to calm down, sir. Sir, calm down. Oh, look at how these guys died. <laughs> they died very intimately. Well, what news? Is Elaine? He is so dead, dude. Thank you. That bastard got exactly what he deserved. My pleasure. And I heard about Nilsine. You have more than fulfilled your part of the bargain. Please. Take this, as payment, and a symbol of my affection. Oh, affection. I'll never forget you. Oh. Well, let's go tell Astrid the good news. Let her know that I just absolutely killed my first contract. Figuratively, and literally. I'm a professional. Mm. This is what I do. So, how went your first real contract? I'm just gonna remain silent, you know? Very well. I respect your discretion. Now. I need your assistance with a matter of a more mm, personal nature. 
It's Cicero. Ever since he arrived, his behavior's been... Well, erratic would be an understatement. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking. Dear sister, I need you to steal into that chamber and eavesdrop on their meeting. It'll be no use clinging to the shadows. They'll see you for sure. No. You need a hiding place. Somewhere they'd never think to look. Like inside the Night Mother's coffin. Is there a body in that coffin? Go now, before they meet, and report back to me with whatever you learn. Okay. So Cicero is, uh, something else. He's quite the character. I met him off camera, and he's, like, textbook definition of a jester. You guys will see. You'll see. I kind of like him. So I'll just get in this coffin. Oh, I have to unlock it first. Oh! Oh! Get on my level. I have to get in there with that thing? Are we like absolutely sure? Are we alone? Yes. <laughs> yes! Alone! <laughs> Sweet solitude! Have you... Have you spoken to anyone? No? No, of course not. I do the talking, the stalking, the seeing, and the saying. And what do you do? Hmm? Nothing! Not... Not that I'm angry. You will talk when you're ready, won't you? Won't you? Sweet night, mother. Poor Cicero. Dear Cicero. Oh. But I will speak. I will speak to you. For you are the one. I'm just the chosen yes, one all the way you. around. Journey to Wallen Road. Speak with Armand Moutier. Tell Cicero the time has come. Tell him the words he has been waiting for all these years. Darkness rises when silence dies. Just pop out and tell him. What? <laughs> what treachery? <laughs> Defiler. Explain yourself. And there's Cicero. Speak, worm. Okay, first of all, don't call me a worm. Second of all, I'm the listener, babe. You lie. The Night Mother speaks only to the listener. Darkness rises when silence dies. What do you think about that? She said those words. To you. Then it's true. She's back. Our lady is back. When I heard Cicero screaming, I knew you'd been discovered. I feared the worst. Are you all right? I feel like I'm watching a soap opera. Please tell me this is some kind of sick joke. Nope, I'm the listener. What? So Cicero wasn't talking to anyone else. Just the Night Mother's body? Yeah, he's just a and little the weirdo. the Night Mother, who, according to everything we know, will only speak to the person chosen as listener, just spoke. Right now. Yeah. To you? Yeah. What did she say? The darkness breaks the silence, yada yada yada, go talk to some French guy. Amand Motier? I have no idea who that is. But Valenrude, that I have heard of, and I know where it is. So I'm going to go check it out, all right? No. No. Listen, I don't know what's going on here, but you take your orders from me. Are we clear on that? The Night Mother may have spoken to you, but I am still the leader of this family. I'll find you when I'm ready to discuss the matter further. I, I don't know, Astrid. I'm kind of thinking that maybe I should be the leader of the Dark Brotherhood now, actually, though. So, we might have beef. I think we're going to put a pin in the Dark Brotherhood quest now. Uh, and to finish it out, I want to go back to Windhelm and return Ulfric's war axe. Let him know that we're going to war. That'll be a good place to end it, I think, you know? Just full of drama. Ulfric, me boy, we're going to war. You're right, Galmar. Again. I'm in no mood to joke. Give the word, my lord, and white rot is yours. 
All right. This is it. Yes! Send the word. Make haste to our camp in White Run. I want you on the front lines. I have a feeling about you. Your place is on that battlefield. I need you there. Like I said, I'm the chosen one through and through. So that's a good place to call it, I think. We're going to war with White Run. War with White Run. Feels like a tongue twister. We're gonna do battle. <laughs> this was a fun one. Got to do the infamous beacon quest, got to kill a couple people, talked to a corpse, started a war. Pretty productive if you ask me. And as a quick reminder, please make sure to check out the links in the description and go vote for me. Please. I wanna win. I hate losing. Plus I did all that cool stuff in this video. Like how could you not wanna vote for me? So just do it. Do it. Do it. Or I'll think you're a nerd. Anyways, thank you all so very much for watching, and I will see you next time.